G'day and welcome, I'm Nook Nook and today I'm going to be showing you how to mine Dino Coin on Raspberry Pi. I'm using Raspberry Pi 4 for this video and for those who are interested in what Dino Coin is, it's more just a fun crypto to mine, uh, just a fun project to I guess work on and so if you're interested in that, you came to the right place and let's get stuck in. Alright, so the first thing you want to do is create a Dino Coin web wallet. This is mine and the link for registering will be in the description and we'll come back to this later. It'll be necessary obviously to send ourselves the Dino coin. Alright, so jump your Raspberry Pi, open your terminal and first thing as always, check that our Raspberry has updated. Next, as you may expect, we want to download a number of packages here. So this is just the normal Python packages in Git. And then we want to also run this command here. Again, just installing packages there. And then we also want to go pip three install pi presence. Next, we want to download the actual file. So I'm just going to copy this across from here, from the website that is. As you can see, I've already got it downloaded. CD, we want to then open DinoCoin. And then we want to run our code here. So we're going to go Python 3 PC underscore minor dot pi. And then this is where you enter your username for DinoCoin. So mine, as you saw, was just Nook Nook. And we want to set our intensity, so I'm just going to go with the recommended here, 95. And then our threads, we're going to go with 4. And because we're using a Rashi Pi, as you can see here, we're going to go with 1. We can identify our name of our Rashi Pi, so I'm just going to call it Raz4. This is Rashi Pi 4. And our donation, let's just set it to one. And there we go. Now we're going to start mining. And we'll come back in a little bit and see how it's going. All right, so jumping back into a web world here, as you can see to the side here, you can see our miner, our Rusty Pack 4, that is, mining on the side here. And our estimated daily profit at four cents. So if you think about our internet cost being about 17 cents per kilowatt hour and the Raspberry Pi using about 120 or well, 0.12 kilowatt hours per day. We're looking at about two cents to one cent of profit here, which I mean is marginal. It's just cool to know that obviously you can mine some Dino coin and make a bit of profit, but realistically, this isn't going to make you money as your Raspberry Pi is probably going to cost enough to offset that and it will take literal years to pay, pay back. But the idea of Dynacoin is just be a fun coin to mine and that's what it is. For those of you who have watched to the end of the video, thanks for watching. Consider subscribing and leaving a like. And if you were watching, you may have noticed that there was a big time difference in the video and between the last video as well. And that was because of the fact that the Dynacoin servers were being migrated during the week I was recording this video. So that really sucked um, and kind of set me back there. But hopefully you enjoyed the video. And if you do so, consider subscribing. It would really help out. And thanks for watching.